Now then everyone, how is everyone? I hope everyone is fine. It's a horrible day out there. So I'm in the hut and I'm just chilling and relaxing. And I've got this idea though, do you know what I mean? I'm not messing in the garden, but I've been pondering this idea. And I don't know where it's come from, to be honest. I don't know if it's from the sleep induced, you know, man flu. I don't know if it's come from that where I've been in the kind of the sweats through the night and this idea has popped into my head. But before that, honestly, massive thank you to everyone out there who just sent in the support. You know, when I did the other one, I was oh, I was at the depth of oh, man, I was freezing cold when I come here, I was shivering on. But it seems to have like, you know, I battled through it. <laughs> I've still got this cough, still killing this like, but a huge thank you. Do you know what I mean? A huge thank you indeed. So the idea is I do want to plant tomato seeds, little tomato seeds, pop, 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 grow them and, and do that. That's not what I'm into, you know, I, I, not this year anyways. What I want to do is experiment. I want to try and buy my tomato plants online and grafted. That's what I'm going for. And I know, well, I know one thing, it will be expensive, oh <laughs> no, and I'm not sure of the results. So that's where you's come in. Do you know what I mean? It'd be nice to know your thoughts on the idea. So I looked into it, you know, and we all know kind of the grafted, everyone says, oh, you get better, you know, it's better for the, the plant, you know, you get a stronger root ball, it, it can withstand, you know, like the disease and the germs, and you get a far bigger yield. So that's what I'm kind of hoping for, but I'm also, you know, it's, it's just a test, it's just a, to play, to be quite, this is my play area, and it's just to find out. Like I say, I know it's, I mean, I think for three, you're talking about 11 pound, maybe 11.99 for three. You get them in 10 centimeter pots. So three plants, you know, if you're doing it with a pack of seeds, a pack of seeds and you know, 1.99 and you're away, but that's not the point. That's not the point, so don't say it, you know, in the comments, oh, it's almost expensive. I know that, I know that, but it's, I don't go out drinking or, you know, daft things like that, you know, so this is my hobby, and it'd be nice to kind of just, it's a play around, keep us excited. But I've looked at the grafted, and I thought, oh, that would make, make a nice little video, you know, doing my own grafting. Then I, oh, I went, no, nah, not, a, not a hope. So I'm not gonna bother with that too fiddly, and I would just, Gah, I'd lose my temper, do you know what I mean, kind of big fingers and just, oh, I'll be cutting the heads off every bloody tomato plant. So what I'm going to do is, remember the last video, I'm, you know, what I kind of, I want minimalist, you know, just the products we're going to use or just the veg we're going to use. So I'm only going to get three varieties of tomato plants. I'm getting the Shirley's, the Gardener's Delight, and I'm, I, as yet, I'm not 100% sure what you know, to, like beef, tomato, whichever one really you can get grafted is probably the, the, the best for me. So I will be buying them online. So I'll, that's a little, you know, that's a worry to begin with because will the bloody come in time? You know, you, I'll buy them now, but will it, you know, the, the, I think it's April, May when they get, you know, you, 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 you're running out of time almost. Do you know what I mean? That's a kind of scary thing. So what I will do is I'll have, I will plant some, you know, fingers behind the, you know what I mean? Fingers behind the back. I'll plant some seeds of them varieties and I'll keep, I'll just keep them to the side, you know what I mean? But actually it'd be nice to just put them ones in on one side of the, the polytunnel and see what, you know, the comparison, what the yields are, you know, what, the actual, the health of the plant looks like, you know, because there's all this like hoo-ha, you know, how good grafting is. And I know in the commercial side of horticulture, everything seems to be bloody grafted these days. You know what I mean? You can't buy a, a bush from a garden centre without having a good look. And there, you know, you can see the little, there it is on the top, it's been grafted on the bush. But in allotment terms, and you know, amateur gardeners, you know, and I, I'm, I'm right down there at the bottom of the amateur gardeners there, it's, grafted's not that, you know, well known. 
have used had some grafted you know tomato plants or i've seen a couple of years ago i started to see like the chili plants coming through and i've never never been down that route but i thought with tomato plants that would be a good little experiment so what i'm going to do is like i say i will buy the three i'll buy six plants each so a total of 18 and well, it gets expensive do you know what I mean <laughs> I best not to tell the wife how much it's cost no but I just take it out of the take it out of the family account just bury it in the family account no one will know so I'll get six Shirley six of the gardener's delight and then six whatever you know I've never looked into it whatever the beef ones are of that and they come like I say in a little 10 centimeter pot and you know i'll just be ready to plant them on so it's the scary thing of you know will they get delivered will they be damaged in the post i'll be, I'll be gutted if that's the case do you know or and will there be you know a, a better plant than the normal because i think you can buy you know when you go to the garden centers and they've got all the kind of you know it's a great they're great moments when you first go in and the whole tomato plants are all there you know the little ones you know they're just 99 pence you know probably 59 pence so you can get them as cheap as chips. So, but these ones will be a plant in a 10 centimetre pot. You're hopefully ready to go in. And it'll be a kind of, you know, I'll be watching me, you know, the calendar as the days, you know, come into April and then May. I have bought, I bought the hottest at that time, Trinidad Scorpion, I think it was, hottest chili plant a few years ago and it came i must admit fantastic you know what i mean so i've seen what it can happen you know what the quality of plant you can get through the post but tomatoes you're kind of your main stock isn't it you know what i mean this is, you don't mess with your tomato crop you know that's what i'm that's what i'm thinking but keep us it keeps you going man. It keeps you excited or keeps you kind of you know interested you know because if it starts becoming mundane and i'm away i'm off so the three will come and like i say throughout the year you know next year 2019 we'll kind of have obviously have updates and it'd be nice just to see what it's you know what they do these these grafted plants i honestly don't know in me heart and by the way i got bloody glue i forgot to mention this i got glue on me bloody cut me 10 pound cord on that pig and roof i got glue on it but by the way it's it is dry you know that there was a little bit of kind of damp there's nothing in it and it's been hideous up here the past couple of days so my hut worked so i'm hopefully intending like i say to get these plants in get them sorted out i don't know if grafted is better like i mentioned there it's all the professionals do the grafting it's all done you know it's obligatory almost but on an amateur side is it you know what i mean is it is it worth it for us like i say it's it's expensive you know what i mean is it is it worth it for the gardeners if or does it need to be cheaper have you tried grafted tomato plants before let honestly let us know because i haven't got a clue basically i'm just gonna you know what i mean got this idea i'll do that I, and i don't know it's going to spoil me whole year's crop of tomatoes so if everyone you know there's a, there's a lot of people there saying Tony man, you crazy old man. <laughs> get your proper tomatoes sorted. I'll do, you know what I mean? I'll I'll quickly change my mind and I'll get some me spares to kind of make the back up. But that's what I kind of want to do. And I don't know if it'll work or not. I would love to, I would heart to heart, I would love to know that it's it's worth it. <laughs> the money's worth it, the time and stress of ordering them's worth it, and the time and stress of waiting for the delivery's worth it, and everything is worth it. <laughs> That's what I'll hope you'll tell us. It's worth Tony, it's worth it. Don't don't worry, lad. Everything will work out fine. <laughs> so do let us know in the comments. Is it is it bloody worth it? Am I going to, is this just a you know what I mean graft you don't have to bother. You, you don't have to bother to one man, it's just a bloody tomato plant, man. Or is it, hey, too, honestly, you'll get a crack and crop there, lad. I'll tell you what, going down the right avenue there. <laughs> it feels like I've took the wrong turn, mind you. This decision is the wrong turn. But we'll see how it goes. And it'll keep us amused, I'm sure. Right, do subscribe. Honestly, thank you so much for kind of sticking by. Especially when I've had this kind of bloody flu. It's kind of knocked us a little bit. But, you know, north... <laughs> 
and all these of England there, we struggle on up here, you know what I mean? It doesn't matter, you know what I mean? We, we get with Lemsip, we drink with Lemsip, cold man, that's how. <laughs> Look after yourselves, catch you next time.